something called sentient IoT. It's got some other names as well. But essentially, it's based on the premise that 80% of all the data that's feeding the LLMs, the large language models, is currently, you know, content, written content, spoken content, video content. And it's been scraped or stolen, depending on your point <laughs> of view, whether you're a content creator, and is being fed into these models. But but the point is that, that we've got 80% of it already. And if the effectiveness of an AI model and the LLM, um, in order for it to be generative... Uh, is based on the data that you, you know, it's only as good as the data you feed it, then the next big frontier is data about things. And that directly brings us to IoT, or in other words, the next big wave of data that's going to train the models for AI is going to come from things. And that, that's not public data. It's going to be things that are owned by companies. So it's private data. There will be some public but it will be data uh, from things. And some people estimate that if we could connect everything in the world, the data from things, um, even if it's just a minimal amount of data per thing, could be a hundred times bigger than the amount of data that we've already trained the LLMs on. 